Oh my gosh, get it, get it, ew, ooh, ooh, get it. Hi guys. Hi my virtual fam. It's your girl, my virtual world. And I'm going to start off this video. No, in the end of the video, I'm not going to um, put in the shout outs. I'm just going to do them right here in the video. Got some fresh wings, some fresh um, L Montre, Monterey. I can't ever say anything right, but anyways, you know, it's the shredded steak and three cheese burrito. I'm eating what I'm craving right now, and this is what I'm craving. And then I got my good old Sprite because I have my water in the refrigerator. I gotta wait for it to get cold because sometimes, you know, I don't like it to be, you know, room temperature. I want it to just be nice, icy cold, you know, it's more refreshing to me, that is. But anyway, shout out to my sis, Lady Swag TV Cooking Plus More. She actually watched the video in full. It was only 14 minutes and 5 seconds, guys. And she watched the full and she dropped the emojis that I told her to drop. Thanks, sis. Let's see if anybody else did it. Hmm. I don't know if Dominique B did it because it's like canceling whatever he dropped. And that's all I see in my comments. Maybe I have to check some other comments. You know, like maybe you two put them. I don't know. They need to get checked out by me before being approved you know where they're under review and stuff but I'm just gonna shout out everybody who came through so shout out to Shauna's life shout out to my boy Andy Appleseed shout out to Strawberry Pixie I know who that is if y'all don't know well shout out to my one of my good friends slash bestie Sticky Northside. Shout out to Sunday ASMR. Great channel. Y'all should check her out. Gold T. Michael. Absolutely love you. Daisy ASMR is a new friend to us. Well, family member for me. Food Tuber. Of course, Dominic B. My girl KB211, my bro Payne Rain, hope I'm saying it right, Linda's Eating Show, Playco Whisper, Kenai Bay, but they said no way friend, no way what, of oh, the desserts, trust me I didn't eat that much, and shout out to Johnny Martinez, guys, I don't know about anybody else, but I feel funny when I can't get somebody's name right. It makes me feel really bad. But anyways, we need to get the grubbing because the fat person inside of me is telling me, eat it, eat it, eat it, eat it. But I've been starting to work out, guys. And anytime that I try to work out, I've told you guys, my body since i was young okay when i was around 140 to 160 anything i do it be killing me like my body is just like this is not it for you sis like exercising is not for you and i'm just like oh what else am i supposed to do to lose weight because i'm not going to cancel out the food that i love like eat less of it yes but am i gonna stop eating it no and then i've noticed that half of pretty much that me and my kids eat have bread 
in it. A lot of it has breading in it, guys. And we're going to talk about something instead of me, like, talking about a show or whatever or what I'm watching. And I'm not going to, like, straight out say what it is. Y'all should already know what's going on. But out of anything that's been going on in the world, out of everything, this is the first time that something comes out and you guys are scared. This is really waking you guys up when you should have been woke a long time ago. Because last time I checked, taking a shower, washing your hands, using hand sanitizer, disinfecting your house, you know, from germs and all that stuff, especially when people in your household are sick. So that it doesn't like, you know, furthermore become a problem. Wiping down stuff around your house, like that shit has, it's been known for years common sense folks that's what you should be doing and all of a sudden now this crap is going on it's affecting people's jobs in schools like they're shutting down this shit they're, they're shutting down schools and and jobs because of it when folks should already know to do all of that when you cough and sneeze cover yourself be considerate be courteous around, uh, 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 you know, about the people around you. Like, stuff like this gets me heated up because I just don't understand. I don't understand. Like, out of anything that can happen, all of a sudden you want to leave the stores empty. So when folks want to get stuff like, like I said, wash your hands, get good old soap and water. It does the job. And all of a sudden, now you guys are freaking out and getting a whole bunch of soap. So you wasn't getting it before. Stuff like this blows my mind. This absolutely blows my mind. Because I've been getting soap. Toilet paper. That's just... These are things that you've, you've needed for years. So... Because of this, you're so worried, but you wasn't worried about anything else. That if anything happened and, you know, we need to stock up on some stuff, you didn't think to stock up then? But why stock on it now? You wasn't worried about it then, sweetheart. You wasn't worried. We're gonna chill. We're gonna get into eating. I just wanted to talk about this. Like, I might sound ridiculous, but y'all get what I'm talking about. Like, I don't know. If there's something that I don't know of, you know what I mean? School me on it. Share your knowledge. We're never too old to be educated on some shit that we don't know. I was wiping down my house and spraying the defectant spray. Way before this whole mess came out. Especially when the kids and I get sick and the kids sometimes get lazy and they don't want to cover their mouth. And I told them, when y'all get sick, you're going to get somebody else sick. Or you're spreading all your germs. And we're all just going to keep being sick. And then tell me why my youngest, I let her play on my second phone, the one that I was looking at the shout outs. Why won't this go off? Anyways. For some reason, she deleted my app from my bank. Mm. 
now I gotta hope that where I wrote it down at it has the accurate like sign in so I can get back in or I'm gonna have to do it all over again thanks daughter I was gonna have pizza but I changed my mind Because the kids and I literally just had pizza some days ago. Now these wings. Are from Friday's. Thank God it's Friday. Oh yeah, happy Friday, y'all. I hope you have a wonderful day. What do you guys got going on for this weekend? And don't let this mess that's going on scare you. Because again, the media and everyone around you wants you to live in fear, pretty much. You guys already know what to do to protect yourselves. Pray to God. It shouldn't stop you from living your life. I'm sorry, but I've taught my kids not to live in fear. If things happen, things happen. We just got to be prepared for it, you know? But living in fear makes it worse. And I feel that's what the government and everybody else, the media, has been trying to get us to do for a long time is freak out. Now I'm not big on traveling. But if I was able to go somewhere, trust me, I'd make sure that trip happened. We got people who work, who have to travel for work. If they just stayed home because of this whole mess going on, how would they financially be able to take care of their kids or their family or themselves? Whatever the case may be. I love buffalo wings. Oh, the sauce is so good. It's like it's spicy, but it's not too spicy. It's just right. Isn't it sad? I can't remember like on most of my videos what I've done. Oh, let's all look back at it. Has has anybody else had that problem?
Well, I do challenge. On how many wings I can eat under like a certain amount of time. How many do you guys think that I can eat? But if you made it just far into the video. A set of we'll drop an emoji. I want you guys to type down Sprite. Can you do that for me? Then if you don't mess, make a mess with your food, it must not be that good. I like how when I was doing my thumbnail, I want to have just took this out of the oven and put it on here. It was steaming. You can see the steam. After I'm done eating this, I'm going to wash my hands. Like, I'm obsessed with washing my hands. I I like the water running through my hand. Let me tell you guys, I'm still trying to catch up to everyone's videos. So I wrote down like channels that I haven't been, you know, been to in, in a while. And I'm gonna catch up on a few videos and share them out. Because again, I can't expect people to go all out for my channel. All of my videos, I haven't done the same for them. Not like a detention I'm just trying to meet new uh, family members, show them love. And for the family members that I've been had. Why are you still active? In that lets me know that I need to head over your way.
y'all already know what I do. I'm still hungry. I didn't eat that much this morning. And since I'm eating all this, I know I got to work out hard tonight before I go to sleep. I just know. And this is how bad it is, guys. When my body is not, like, it's never going to get used to exercising. Has anybody else ever had a problem, like, when you're working out? You don't even have to be doing all that much. You could be doing arm exercises or leg exercises. And, like, your throat, like, I don't know if it's just me, but like I said, it's been a problem for years. But I feel like there's, like, blood in my throat. Like, I don't know how to explain it, but it's just so weird because <laughs> I weighed less when I was younger and even at school and PE and stuff I'd always feel that way like when they make us run a mile or whatever I couldn't do it but the PE teacher kept saying like it's part of your grade so you have to you have to do something and when I explained to them how how you know running made me feel they was like well then you can walk speed walk or jog whatever works for you but like I said you got to do something so that's what I did And it's not like I don't want to work out. Like, literally, exercising is not for me. But I'm going to do it. I know a lot say if you just train your body, it's all about willpower, then your body will get used to it. So, we'll see. And we'll see if I see any results. If I weigh myself and it's actually telling me that I've lost some pounds i will i will keep you guys informed on what's going on with me okay and i'm kind of like debating if i want to go over to my brother's house this weekend to see my nephew because i absolutely love him and i can't see him during the week because the kids got school right now but i can spend more time with him more so during the summer because most likely the kids will be with their dad which brings me joy like I could be doing anything else while my kids are with their dad and I want to be with my nephew like but I love you my virtual fam the girl is out I am not going to tell you guys when the next time I'm gonna upload a video because I can't make any promises um, I'm just taking my time with this and I still have a lot of older videos that needs love too so please show them some love like I was working hard on my channel like I was dropping videos like back to back to back before like so yeah those videos have been neglected show them some love if you're oh so kind I appreciate it and I will do the same for you when I'm able to get across your channel so each time that I, you know, see someone and I know that I haven't been to their channel in a while, I will make it up to you guys. Till then, see ya. Mwah.